Hi everyone, we're here with Kat De Castro. Kat, how does it feel to be here at Binibini Filipinas USA? It's actually my first time here, but I've been hearing about it for years already. So it's really surreal that I'm here right now and I'm part of the judging board. So it's pretty much exciting and I've met all the girls. I met everybody and made the best woman win tonight. You flew all the way from the Philippines to be here. What made this event so important for you? Well, because aside from the fact that it is being sponsored by the Philippine Department of Tourism, the the ones who actually are behind it are my friends as well. And they've been asking me since May to come to the Philippines, I, uh, to come here to LA, and I've only confirmed like two weeks ago. <laughs> now I'm here, I flew 13 hours, I'm still jet lagged, but I'm glad to be here. You look beautiful. Thank you. Thank you. Now as a representative of the Department of yes. Tourism, how do you get people motivated to still go to the Philippines yes. despite the negative news at times? Well, uh, I was in an event yesterday where you know, a lot of the members of the Philippine community were there as well, and I had to assure them that as my capacity as Undersecretary of the Department of Tourism, that it is still more fun in the Philippines. We are still the best destination when it comes to Southeast Asia and we still offer competitive packages uh, compared to our other Asian countries. So it's safe in the Philippines. Please come and visit. Bring a friend if you want. So I'll see you there. What do you think is the most important criteria for the contestants as a judge? I would say that how the girl would answer the question. I think that intelligence surpasses all physical beauty anyway. You look beautiful. Who are you wearing today? I'm actually wearing an Wood, one of the legendary designers of the Philippines. Thank you. Thank you so much, Kat. Thank you. Thank you.